Well, we are only three weeks into the new year, but mortgage rates have already gone up roughly half a percent since January 1st. And industry experts expect that upward trend to continue all year. What the rising rates mean for prospective home buyers in tonight's Your Money Matters. When interest rates go up, it really affects any buyer that's in the market right now. After more than 15 years in real estate, Tyler Goff has found the home buying process usually takes around 90 to 120 days from your first mortgage approval to closing on a house. But prospective home buyers stuck in that window right now are seeing a big impact. If they got quoted at a lower interest rate, their payment, and now in the middle of the process, that interest rate goes up. Well, it kind of moves the field goal post on them. First of the year, rates were at about three and a quarter. And now they've gone from three and a quarter to roughly three and three quarters. While a half a percent may not seem like much. Let's say a $250,000 loan. It's going to be about $70 a month. It makes a big difference on how much house buyers may be able to afford. For the same payment, instead of a $250,000 house, it's a $235,000 house. So in the last month, people have lost roughly $15,000 worth of buying power. Senior mortgage banker Kevin Carlson says the industry is bracing for even more of an impact throughout the year as the Federal Reserve works to compete with inflation. Ever since uh, the response to COVID started, they've been intentionally keeping interest rates low and they're beginning to lift their thumb off that scale, that is not going to stop. That will only intensify. And while the rising rates are adding to the pressure of a housing market that's already seen a roughly 20 percent increase in home prices over the past year. Demand in Sioux Falls itself is only going to get bigger and bigger. Realtors say now is still the best time to get into the market and secure a house and a low mortgage rate before prices climb even more. And people that are in the market right now, I would say don't give up hope. There are people every day, there are people that are winning bids. And I would say just because we're expecting interest rates to go higher in the future, the sooner you can get into a kind of locking in a mortgage loan, the better. It's good advice, but it is easier said than done in this competitive real estate market where Sioux Falls is seeing some of its lowest ever inventory of homes available for sale. But while the competition may mean fewer choices, Goff says he's still been able to get most customers into a home in that same 90 to 120 day time frame. Well, today